Welcome back to Gear Daddy. I'm your host, Daddy Troy. Today I'm going to share with you some activities you can do with your kids, from cardboard castles to painting their own Van Gogh, all the way to making the best paper airplane ever. books have come a long way. This is a group of coloring books by Dover Publications in which they take a great artist's paintings or works of art, they remove the color, and then allow your kid to actually color it. You'll notice on the inside cover and on the back cover they have a whole series of Matisse paintings. These are very color friendly for kids. You'll find that your kid's crayon palette at home has all of these colors in it or most of them. Kids really groove on these uh, somewhat simple shapes and they have a great time with this. Another one by Dover Publications is this one that's a Van Gogh, and this is called a stained glass coloring book. I really like this one because it has a type of vellum paper on the inside, and the kid can again pick which Van Gogh painting they want to do. Once you're done coloring it or painting it, you can then put this up on a window in your house, and it looks like stained glass. Kids really dig that too. Here's another great book called DIY Kids. You can get it at DIYKids.org. It helps you and your kid do great projects like pop up cards or make your own stuffed animals, do great things with magnets and t-shirts. I really like this book. It has over 90 projects in it. My son and I have been going through it almost page by page. We've been doing things like making cardboard castles or making our own wrapping paper or scanning little objects like bottle caps and making computer art out of them. It's a great book. It shows kids where design and art meet and also helps kids take ownership of their own projects. Here's a paper airplane book by Klutz Press. I love everything Klutz does. This particular one has 10 different paper airplanes in it, all the way from the Nakamura lock to the, uh, the hurricane. You might be worried about putting a kid's eye out or something, but most of the airplanes in this book are, are blunt ended. It has really simple instructions for a mom or dad to go through and help the kid make the paper airplanes. You don't need any special materials because they include all of this really cool colored paper in the back for your kid to make the airplanes out of. Well, that's all this week for Gear Daddy. If you've got an idea of an activity that works really well with kids, let us know. Go to dadlabs.com. Upper right-hand part of the screen is the Dad Labs crib. It's a community where dads grab a virtual beer and we sit around and we talk about all things that are father-related. We'll see you next time at dadlabs.com.